Tip number 31, eat foods from all of the food groups each day. This is a great way to ensure you are getting all the nutrients your body needs and it helps to ward off any diet deficiencies. Tip number 32, try to eat breakfast within an hour of waking up. This is the best way to give your body the jump start it needs. Don't wait until you are really hungry. Breakfast is important, but you don't need to stuff yourself. The idea is that you're breaking the fast from not eating all night. Tip number 33, your diet should include all aspects of the food groups including carbohydrates. In fact, your diet needs to be about 50 to 55% carbs. Carbs are a great source of energy. Those diets that prohibit carbohydrates are actually harming you and only making you crave them that much more. Tip number 34, proteins should make up only 25 to 30% of your diet. Far too much emphasis is put on meat as the main part of your meal. In actuality, it should be considered more of a side dish rather than the main course. Tip number 35, fats should make up 15 to 20% of your meal. This is really all the fat your body needs. A lot of this is going to be in your diet in the form of cream, sugar and the like. Tip number 36, eat more white meat than red meat. White meat includes chicken, fish and some other fowl. Red meat includes beef and pork. Tip number 37, try to go as vegetarian as you can. This really is a healthier lifestyle, even if you can't cut meat out completely. The more fruits and veggies you can eat the better. The more meat you cut out, the more fat you can cut out of your diet as well. However, protein is important, so be certain that your option allows you to maintain good protein levels. Tip number 38, white bread is good, but high-fiber multigrain breads are much better. These breads are another way to add more fiber to your diet and they also have a good protein level. Tip number 39, pork does not assist in weight loss in any way. The less pork you eat, the better off you will be when trying to lose weight. Pork has a high fat content and includes food items such as bacon, ham and sausage. Tip number 40, limit your sugar intake as much as possible. If you must have sweetener in your coffee and tea, try to find an artificial sweetener that you don't mind the taste of. However, these things are not all that healthy either and should be limited as well.